we're not just trying to spam you or to show you a picture of something that you should be buying, but rather giving brands an opportunity in the right moments to give you value back. And so really our mantra as a company has been to create value out of moments. And the big vision here in a nutshell is very simple. Moments and achievements don't just exist in games, they exist pretty much everywhere. How can we harness all of these and how can we reward the world? You are the most powerful force in your life. And I know it sounds so obvious, or maybe it isn't that obvious, but guess what? Guess who moves your hand? Guess who emails that person you really wanted to talk to? Guess who starts the business? It's not anybody else, it's you. And if you don't do it, you failed already. And at the end of the day, the first step is usually the most important one because people will rally behind you once you've taken the first initiative. Asking is so unbelievably underrated. Most of you expect someone to be able to help you without, how do you expect someone to help you without you even asking them what you need help on in the first place? Like it's just so obvious. Like people, don't be afraid to ask. And the main reason why it makes so much sense is because you're a student, you're young, you have the excuse, you're supposed to be learning all the time. You use that card all the time. It always works. By the way, a quick 101 on PR pitching. Just find out the last five articles that they've written. Find out what beats they usually write on. Refer to a few topic items in there and they'll love you. A lot of people don't even do that and it's so simple. People are very vain. Let them be vain and then them respond to you and give you what you want. It's awesome. You will have this pit in your stomach if you feel that something's wrong. It's wrong. Always listen to it because if you don't, you'll never have the instinct and the speed of decision making that's required to be an entrepreneur. But remember there are things that you're, there are your strengths that you need to hold on to that are important for you to use in the ways that you build your business. Don't try to fix the flaw that you know you've had for a while. Try to augment the strength that you have because when you're being audacious, that's how you get differentiated because you are irreplaceable if you're the best at that one thing. If an idea was easy, everybody would have done it already. But if it's hard, that's even more reason to do it because when you actually do it, nobody else will do it, right? And that's very important to remember that there are very easy ways to go about being an entrepreneur. Part of it is not trying to take that easy path. That's how you become a great sort of revolutionary or someone who's trying to change a market or an industry forever is to try not to do the easy thing.